Have you ever wanted to add sound effects to your live stream so that you could have cheering or clapping or a drum when you make a joke? There's now a brand new feature inside of the Melon app from Logitech that allows us to do just this and all you have to do is hit a couple of buttons. You don't even have to import your own sounds, which is incredible. Let's take a look at how to do this. Inside of the Melon dashboard, you're actually gonna look down at the bottom to the button that says React. React right now is in beta, but they will be moving out of that soon. And when you click on the React button, they do have options that come up. Now, right now we've got air horn, clap one and two, chant, cheer, gasp, laugh one and two, and drum one and two. So when you do something that needs to get people's attention, you may want to use the air horn clip. And some of these are shorter and some of these are longer. You can cut them off whenever you want or you can let them play out, but they're not too terribly long. Now, let's say you say something that is really significant that is one of those like mic drop moments. You may want to have your crowd cheering for you. This is a great way to get people's attention while you are on that live stream because we're so used to live streams being kind of a quieter thing. Sometimes you can put background music in there, which we've talked about before on the channel. But this is a really nice way to get that little sound bite in there to get their attention. So you have the ability to use those different versions of clap or to get people chanting. We also have the ability to have that cheer, which is fantastic when you say something that's really smart. If you say something that's kind of on the shocking side, you may want a gasp or you may want laughter from your crowd in a couple of different versions. If of course you make a joke, which is my favorite of all of these sound effects. And we've got the second version as well. Now, at the moment, we only have these couple of audio clips, but they will probably be growing and enhancing what they're doing as they go. So give them feedback, give us feedback on what is your favorite, and let me know how you're going to be using this. But real quick, a couple of best practice tips for you before you jump in. Do not use these every five seconds. If you do, they lose their effectiveness. You wanna make sure you're using these strategically as you are doing your live stream. Do not go all out on these. Be very sparing with this. If you're not sure, don't use it. If you're not sure, don't use it. If you're not sure, don't use it. Only in significant moments should you be using these sound effects because that will really enhance what you're doing and get their attention. Now you also wanna make sure that as you're using these, you're doing it intelligently because if you are talking through them, it could make it hard to hear your audio or it could make it hard to hear the sound effect. So let's say you are making a joke. You're gonna to wanna to do that little pause there. Now, if you are saying something that's significant, you want the clapping, you can start at the end of what you're saying, but then you're gonna to wanna to pause for it to clap so that people can hear you. Now, if it starts slow or quieter, you can talk over it a little bit, but don't talk over the entire thing because again, what's the point in that? That's just like background music in the restaurant while you're live streaming, right? We don't want that. So you wanna make sure that you're using this at effective times to get that attention while you are doing your live streams. If you got questions on this, go ahead and drop that down below for me so we can build up what you are doing on your live streams and help you to create effective live streams right now inside of your platform. And if you need more help, livestreamactionplan.com where I'm literally handing you scripts that you can be doing online for your live streams without any work or effort. Just fill in a couple of blanks and go live. This is done with you content to make your live stream life a little bit easier. I'll answer your questions down below and hit that subscribe and notification bell. Every single day, we are dropping brand new videos on TikTok, YouTube, on Instagram, on live streaming, and on the tools and resources you need to help level up what you're doing inside of your social media marketing so that you can get back to work doing what you love and not spend all your time trying to figure out what to do on social media. I'll see you in the next episode.